And we have our final team. Team number 10 is Lauren Pearson, a sophomore at the University of Georgia pursuing a degree in public relations and her instructor, Allison Hain, the director of Dance Effects and owner of Open Call Competition. Let's take a look at their video. This has been a totally unique year. Um, Lauren jumped right in and has been taking class with me. So we've <laughs> been able to dance together all uh, the earlier semester. We've gotten to learn each other's styles, which has been really fun. I think it's really important that Alpha Chi supports Project Safe because it sends a message of women helping women, which is, I think is just a really strong and important thing that we need to remember, especially as sorority women. We're all together, we're always doing things and having a great time, but it's really great to set aside specific time to reflect on those who might not have our situations and find ways that we can volunteer and help and serve people that just aren't in our exact place of life. Talk about like different kinds of partners. That was a partner who was already invested in the cause that we were, we were working towards it was really cool. Um, Rise Up totally made sense. It was a message of uh, going against all odds. It was a message of perseverance. It was, a, of course, a very relatable song and everybody knows it, so it just lent itself so well to having a contemporary piece and, and somebody who could really help portray that message. So this is Lauren Pearson. <laughs> and this is Allison Hayne. And we're Team 10. Woo, rise up. Unfortunately, Lauren is not able to be here this evening due to an injury. We wish her a speedy recovery. Caitlin Butchner will join will dance in her place. She and Allison will perform a contemporary dance to Rise Up by Andrea Day. The silence is a quiet And it feels like it's getting hard to breathe And I know you feel like dying But I promise we would take the world to its feet Move I won't dance Bring it to its feet Move I won't dance That we have each other So Allison, you and the entire Dance FX staff have been so good with Project SAFE. Why is this group so important to you? Um, at Dance Effects, we so love, uh, as everyone does the work that Project SAFE does in the community, um, they make such an amazing difference. But they also make it so easy to be a part. They make fun, tangible, relatable events like this where uh, you get to be a part of the difference you make in your community. So the song Rise Up obviously lent itself to you know, conquering uh, domestic violence and empowering victims, but also gives us a chance, I think in the audience, to do our own, <laughs> own rise up, to go vote, to go 
go donate to contribute and to make, make a difference. Uh, Project Safe's made it a beautiful platform for us to get to express ourselves and enjoy the stars of our community. Uh, and that now you have that chance to contribute too. Now, can you step in at the very last moment, I think with about 48 hours notice, what was that experience like? Uh, it was wonderful. It was fine. Any chance that I get to dance with one of my best friends is um, kind of a no-brainer. So I'm glad that you wrote me into doing this. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. And let's hear from the judges. April? Well, um, contemporary is one of my favorite genres of dance. It's so beautiful and expressive, and you guys executed it wonderfully. It's one of my favorite songs. So. I was about to roll out behind you and start twirling around. <laughs> but um, it's just, you guys did a beautiful job. Your expression and your full use of your bodies, you know, your leg extensions, your kicks, everything. It was just very beautiful. I really enjoyed that. Thank you. Sean? Um, being able to watch the two of y'all dance is uh, such a joy, watching y'all dance together. Um, and since this, uh, you're both professionals and this isn't technically uh, gonna be in the competition, I can say whatever I want. Uh, Caitlin, I love watching you express your brilliance and your gift and losing yourself in something and sharing that with us. And I am so lucky that I get to do that for the rest of my life. I love you very dearly. <laughs> Allison, I like you a bunch. <laughs> um, great job, Allison. Uh, no, I mean, you're absolutely right. You guys are amazing to watch. We all know that, and you're so connected, and it's obvious to see. My favorite part was watching the suspense and the breathing and the way that you use time and the space of the stage. I think that that added to the intensity of the music and I thought it was just absolutely beautiful. Um, the, pir the pirouette sequence at the beginning, you guys are just nailed, you nailed it, so you set the tone early. Um, but I, I just, I mean, I could, I could watch you guys all day. It was amazing. Thank you, we are down to the wire now. I do have a update on the voting outside. So um, on the voting update for the youth in third place is team two, Bo and Gabby. In second place is team number five, Maya and Delaney. In first place is Mary Frances and Una. And on the adult side in third place is team 10, Lauren and Allison. Uh, in second place is team number three, Alonzo and Joanne. And in, in first place is Phil and Natalie. So thank you. We are down to the wire. It is in your hands to determine who will take home the coveted audience favorite award. Remember, you can vote as many times as you want for as many teams as you like. You can make donations by cash, check, or credit card in the lobby. And if you don't want to get up, just flag down one of the people in the blue aprons who can take your donation and register your votes. When we return, we'll announce our other event sponsors and have two more exhibition dances. This time, we'll see you back in 10 minutes. <laughs>